Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angel. I just really just I'm a dork when it comes to God. Like, I just I'm cuckoo for him, man. Like he's really doing things in my life that I can't explain. The things that are happening to me, I can't explain. I'm just becoming a responsible human being. Well, let me tell you what I mean by that, right? So I got my taxes, right? I didn't buy anything that I did not need. You know, I invested a little bit in my business. I paid some bills up so I can save some money. Like, I'm doing big girl things. And you know, I was really disappointed in myself, like, the whole day. It was just like, like, ugh. oh, my God. Like, now I don't have a lot of money because, like, I paid all this stuff. And then it's just like, he was showing me, like, the, the, the this, the this. And then like the stuff I got from my business, you know, it's just like, I'm really getting how this could be a business and how I can make money. Like, I always knew I could, right? Oh, I knew I could, like I did not doubt myself, but like I doubted myself just a little bit, right? And as I'm doubting myself, like I'm just doing math, like just doing some math, like your girl don't even like math, but I'm doing some math and the math is math. Like, the math is math and everything is making sense. I'm making sense. I've decided to get Amaya in some therapy, you know, give her somebody to talk to besides me because I realized that, you know, some people do need therapy. And there's some things about, like, just trauma or just experiences about life that I can't explain in words that someone else can. So I want to give her that. She deserves that. She's super excited about it. Like, she's telling me the type of therapy that she wants to do and everything. Like, I just think that it's a good thing. It could be a really good thing. And, I, like, I, I I thought about it all night. You know, like, uh, do I really want some white person? Like, no way. Like, I ain't doing nothing to this motherfucking baby. So, whatever she says, she says it. You're going to figure out. Like, she's really, like, Maya, she knows how to. Yeah, she's her mama's child, but I want to give her that. She deserves that. And just listening to my daughter, like really listening to the things that she says, knowing now like what I have to put in her at such a young age, and not, not even like rah rah, like just like, she's been doing this thing, right? Where she kind of lies. And I'm realizing that it starts like that just little lies me letting her get away with little lies so this morning like she had put some blue some blue lipstick like it was so bright blue right and like it wasn't on her face when she first woke up so she did this in the matter of time when i was changing elijah so i look up at her and i'm like amaya why is that on your lip she said it was on my lips last night and i'm like you're lying like who lies to their mom i just looked at you so are you telling me you think i'm stupid you think that i didn't just see my baby's face and know that that blue lipstick that notice noticeable blue lipstick wasn't on your face and then you know she's getting all in me mommy i got it she's it's, I'm like, it's not even about that. I don't care about the lipstick. Do you, shorty? Like, if you want to wear blue lipstick, go ahead. But, like, it's just the fact that you lied to me. And I was just telling her, like, I am your biggest cheerleader in this life, you know? And I don't want to enable my daughter to do bad things, you know? Just always sweeping another rug, sweeping another rug, sweeping another rug. Like, fuck no, because then that rug gets so piled deep. And then she becomes an adult that can't deal with consequences because she ain't never had them so like i decided not to you know yell or anything i just decided to tell her like if the police come knocking on my door right now and they said amaya did this 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 and you just lied to me so i had that doubt in my mind that you're a liar and i would tell the police to get you get you out of my house like make her responsible for the things she does because it has to start now like little lies, just little things that I'm just realizing that she's doing. I'm pretty sure she's always done. My eyes have just been closed, so I just ain't been seeing it properly. But it's just little things. Little things, like just hanging around the wrong people. And she knows the right thing to do. But they're doing the wrong thing, and the wrong thing looks better. And you don't want to be isolated because I'm like, girl, I am your mother. I'm outside with y'all. I'm watching y'all. These girls' mamas ain't out here. 
they acting real grown like y'all need to be outside checking on these kids because they got boyfriends they got all types of shits going on like the shit I hear and everybody like all the kids they think I'm pretty cool around here let me tell you why because they know I'm a youtuber <laughs> period so they all like me they all come to my door and like tell me when Maya's doing something crazy like and I get on her I get on her but not like discipline like whooping her butt like she that does not hurt her because it didn't hurt me if she's anything like me she just needs me it reassuring her that her thoughts like her knowing that it's wrong it's wrong if you can't do that with your mom sitting right there then you aren't supposed to be doing it because you're not only disappointing me at that point you're disappointing yourself and god now letting her know that at a young age because i don't think enough parents are doing this and i'm not judging i'm relating because i wasn't prior <clears throat> like just being like a kid enjoying being a kid like why are you in a room full of kids right and y'all all on y'all phones no let's let's play like let's be kids like what do you want to do a puzzle like let's play hide and seek like let's be kids literal kids like i'm like it's hard. i'm addicted to my phone my phone is still off at this moment and i'm so embarrassed by it but in all actuality like i'm so freed i've never not had a phone like i've had a phone since i was like in the sixth grade and only reason i had a phone is because i stole and left shit to accumulate a phone and i took a bus to a mall and bought a phone from a mall like that's why i had a phone but like I've never not had a phone. I sort of just not have one. Like, I realize I don't know anything. I don't know how to get from here to there. Like, without my GPS. Like, I just realized how, like, this phone is a crutch. Like, if the fucking world was just to, like, lose electricity, I, I would know what to do. Like, I don't know people's numbers. I don't even know how to, like, I guess you could look well if there was no email i couldn't even email it i don't know i just don't know enough to be productive in the real world honestly and the world's just making it so easy to just be dumb like it makes me so sad that like i told my sister like i can't come to your house because i'm so scared to get lost without my gps like i don't even know how to pick up a map a map and read it i can't look at a satellite and know what it means I couldn't look at a map and know that on the sides were rivers. Like, it would take me a minute. But I realized it, you know, like, oh, maybe that's water. But where is this water coming from? Is it the, the I wouldn't know. Like, I'm crippled. <laughs> I'm essentially crippled. Like, I don't know anything. Like, they're, like, I don't know how to pick up a freaking dictionary and actually look at what a definition of something is. Like, I look at my phone, like, what does this word mean? And then it gives me this definition. But, like, wow not having that is just like it's new it's new and i'm realizing like just the blessing of not having a phone i realize i don't even need it gets really like hard for me like i don't i just love my phone it's early now like i do i do i, do, I love my phone but like i'm paying all this money for all these phones getting all these upgrades and all this thing is doing is just keeping me a zombie to it like i paid all this money i better be on it right but like time time with my little minions important precious valuable time that i only get one time like the moments the things the just just realizing this oops i woke up this morning and I, like it was just so like it's nice outside like it's just a nice little breeze like i just ran to my car so excited like, ee, yes thank you god for the nice weather like it's so nice like just that like oh my goodness it's not so cold that i'm like <laughs> i had to like defrost my car none of that it was just nice it's nice and I thank God for it. The little things, the little things, just all the people that I like made contact with yesterday, just telling people like, you're beautiful, you're beautiful. Do you know how many people told me that I'm wrong? Like me, beautiful, you, 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 beautiful. I've never seen nobody that looks like you. Never, never. I've been in this drive through all day. I ain't seen nobody that look like you, so you're beautiful, you're unique, and you're special. That's how I talk to people. You're God's child. Why wouldn't I talk to you like that? He talks to me like that. He wants me to give you everything he gives me, but I'm going to give it to you, like, in a delicious way. Like, 
I love y'all. And I don't even know y'all. And right now I'm talking to myself, so I don't even know who y'all are. But I love y'all. I love y'all, and I'm loving me. I'm loving me. You feel me? I feel good. I look better. My skin's clearing up. Like, I just got me some little rubbing alcohol for my face. Like, my dad's been telling me about some uh, black soap and green alcohol. That's all you need. I'm spending all this money on face stuff and all you need is some black soap and some rubbing alcohol. Boom! Boom! We got like a, a baddie on our heads. That's a, I feel so good, y'all. I feel so good. Like, if I was to have wings right now, they would be flapping. They would be like flappity, flappity, flaps. Like, I just, I can't explain this feeling. I can't explain this smile. Other than God saved me. He gave me back everything that was deprived of me. Deprived. I didn't get as a child. Why do I be trying to use these big words to fit in with you? I don't know big words. Uh, I learned them from my sister. She just stopped pretending because every time I try to say big words, that's when I start, like, I don't know. I get, no, I don't know big words, but I'm smart. I'm smart, and I'm realizing how smart I am. And I played dumb for so long that it's hard for me to realize how smart I am because, like, Everybody like a little dummy. Like, girl, that girl is so dumb. She don't know nothing with actuality. I'm very smart and I'm just listening to you. Learning you. Realizing. I don't even like you. <laughs> the old me. Not the new me. The new me is better, you know. But, like, everything about me. Everything about me I love. From the top of my head to the tips of my toes. I love me and he did this for me he did this for me and he can do this for you and this relationship that I built with him cannot be broken it can't be shaken he won't leave me he won't leave me he love me that nigga love me <laughs> I'm sorry he knows my heart, but for real, I love him, and I would do anything for him. I would do anything for you because he loves you. I can't just, I don't want this love all to myself. Like, this is a lot of love, y'all. It's like too much love to just not give. Like, it's that type of love. Like, he loves me so much, I want to give you love, hope, belief, your future, your birthright. This is our birthright. Our birthright. Can you hear me? We're kids of a king. So that makes us princes and princesses, kings and queens. We're special. Each and every one of his children he made special. I'm not excluding not a soul, not a person. I don't care what you look like. None of that. Who you love. Shoot, if you love them, I love them too. I love them more because God loves man. I love us. I'm doing this for us. And despite of everything we see in the world, all the crazy, all the crazy, I'm just letting y'all know that there's more. There's more. Like, I'm learning things that I never learned. And, like, I'm not disappointed at any other choices I've made. I'm about to go skip down to the rent, and I mean, to the office and pay my rent. Skip back home. Like, I made some plans to go see my dad. Even though it scares me, like, being out of my element time. I would hate myself if I missed out on what little time we might have left with each other. Like, I don't want to live a life with regrets. I don't want to live a life letting my fear control me. Ooh, another thing. I went to work. I mean, I went to work. They asked me to go get coins or they went to get money from the bank. And I did it. At first, I was like, no, no GPS. I don't even care if it's up the street. Like, I hate to be lost. You know what I did? I did it anyway. And I looked around me. I looked around my surroundings. And I was like, oh, it's right there. Like, it's literally right there. Like, it was up the street, just like she said. 
And I almost talked myself out of that experience of just being excited that I did something with all my phone. <laughs> I did that. He did that for me. I can do this. I can do this. I don't need all this. I don't need all this fancy stuff. I'll probably never get an upgrade again in my life. Like, I won't. I won't. I don't know if I can not have an iPhone, though. Because, like, I just become so, like, I'm so used to iPhone. Like, if I was to, not saying there's anything wrong with Androids, but if I was to just become an Android user, like, I would just be an Android user and I just wouldn't know what to do. But, like, uh, he's doing something. I don't know yet. But, like, I just, getting an Android is a god. I don't know. I don't know why you'd want that for me. Like, I should get my phone. Like, look at, look at It's, like, nice. Like, it's nice. Like, I know how to heal that. Like, I got my pop talker. Like, I already, like, I already have the phone. I don't know what to do. Just kidding, but just that, always that, and just getting more comfortable with me, all of me, all of this, all of this, all of this sexiness, this lusciousness, this, what is rock? I cannot believe this. Hey girl, hey. You feel good, yes. I look better. <laughs> I'm just gonna end this video with a moment of silence because like, I just wanna sit in me. I'm just starting now. Bye guys, until my next video.